thanks. One of these days. Um, thank you. Um, Joseph, you want to go next? Perfect. I wasn't planning on reciting this one at all, but keeping the Toy Story theme going, there's a very profound stanza in this next piece that only those who have seen the movie will understand, but here I go. It's called 16 Years of Mania, 1999 to 2015. Well, the mania returned with uh, the election of Trump and I will embrace it till my death because it's very productive. Here we go. 16 years of mania after I watched a woman die. Thousands of pages of poetry I left the ambulance to cry. I became a Johnny Appleseed prolifically planting my rhyme, praying that love in each verse would withstand the trials of time. War is death by tens of thousands and often by millions as well. So the murders I saw as a medic exposed me to understand war's true hell. 16 years as Buzz Lightyear until medicine brought me into the store to realize I was just a toy who believed I could interrupt war. 16 years of trying, time will tell if I was a fool. I surrendered my life to foresee and prevent, hoping to be the living God's tool. 16 years of mania, no one can say I didn't try. Thousands of pages of poetry since I watched a woman die. Which is why that's a great, I write- That's a great poem, that's a great poem. Which is why I write things like this. Cowards with guns who don't know the spirit and need a weapon to kill will think they are holy as they bloody their brethren, unaware by the devil they're ill. Cowards with guns think they're awesomely special for being able to be anti-life, able to kill even when told they shouldn't, the rebellious will drink their own strife. Murder the messengers who needs a gashagi when the devil has offered its fruit. And the fallen find it tasty as they offer their praises and to their drunk captain salute. The tongue of the wicked gets all the more flagrant, enabled by the putzes who steal. Willing to betray what's fair and what's decent, to keep the fantasy of lordship their deal. To make the fantasy of lordship their deal. Yeah, I said it. Stegosaurus soul. Okay, and now I'm going into this one that needs to be said. I wish I could have retired it, but this needs to be said. Trump insults sanctuary cities because we represent something he won't. We prove we can thrive in diversity, making prey of the different we don't. Trump has a hair for our culture, though his Twitter exists in its heart. He's angry and wants to destroy us for not agreeing to tear others apart. Like a bully on playgrounds is boastful, insisting they're smart and they're tough. They pick the ways of aggression, not seeing their logic is fluff. Sure, it looks good for a moment, and beneficiaries can break out in song. But just because dens of thieves become richer doesn't mean in the end they're more strong. Doesn't mean in the end they're not wrong. Where is the T-Rex among us? It is extinct and echoed in bones. So it will be for the warmonger puppet who delights in war's evil drum tones. <laughs> 